What it is, what it do, folks. It is your boy, the Mikey J, in the mother place to be. And I have a tutorial today on how I um, record my Let's Plays. Yes, if I can talk. Um, basically, it's the um, the way that I put the overlays on and how I have scrolling text and um, just how to set all that up in open broadcaster software, OBS for short. Um, the links will be in the, the description on how to download everything that I um, basically what you'll need to get all this done. And um, first off is how I put my overlay on. Um, um, basically, left side right here, this little box down here under scenes. This is basically how you set um, set your whatever you're showing on screen up. So that's how you set that up. The sources, on the other hand, is how how you make everything go, for lack of a better word. Um, so what I'll do now to get my overlay on the screen, I'll right click in the sources box, go to add, and I'll hit image. And then that name pop up and you can name it whatever you want. And then you'll find the image and for this one I'll use my crystal dust overlay and go to open hit OK now you see it pops up on the screen so now what you want to do is um, you're gonna resize it so um, I make all my overlays in 7 uh, 1280 by 720 so I wouldn't need to adjust the ratio and I will show you how to adjust the ratio on some other stuff um, when I add in the game so I'm just going to adjust this to the actual size of the screen so what I want to do for that is I'll hit edit scene right here and now um, a red box goes around the actual overlay and then you can drag it all the way to the edge of the scene and that's it'll if it's um, a picture that's made in 1280 by 720 uh, I forget all the, the numbers and stuff, but if it's the HD um, dimensions, it will always stay in the screen. So, um, so I've got it full screen. So now you guys can see the overlay is over my desktop and that's pretty much all you see. Now to add the, the game in. Um, with Visual Boy Advance, your computer does not recognize Visual Boy Advance or Desmume as a game. So, but with the great thing about OBS is you can capture anything in the window and not even get the, the top border. So what you want to do is right click in the sources box yet again, go to add and you're going to go to window capture and boom. And does it pop up? Yes, it pops up. So what you would do is this window right here, you would choose your window and go to visual boy advance or Desmume or however you want. Well, Desmume is a little different. Um, I'll probably put up a tutorial on that a little bit later. But um, what you would do is you want to tick enter window, keep that tick because if you do the entire window, it's going to show the uh, file bar and all that kind of stuff. So tick enter window, and then you would um, whether you not you whether or not you want to show your mouse, you hit capture mouse cursor or untick it to not capture it. Okay, and then pretty much anything else you don't want to mess with. Everything else is pretty cool, and you hit okay. Now you see it popped up in the right hand corner and you can see now if you drag it it's going to keep its ratio see that how I get it to fit in my in the little box that, that I made in the overlay what you want to do in OBS you want to hold left shift you hold left shift and then then you drag so that means you can um, basically um, leave out the ratio and scale it to however however big you need it so what I do is um, just get it to the box if you can want to be a dick don't be a dick it's not cool to be a dick but yeah get it to the box and then it's just not gonna work for me like that but um, and then you scale it to however big you need it to be and now you see that it's sitting on top of the overlay to get it down from the overlay what you want to do is you want to click um, 
your window capture right here under here right click it and then go to order and then you're gonna move down now it's underneath the overlay as you guys can see in the top left hand corner and then if you want you can holding left shift bring it all the way down just like that now I see that it's uh got a phone I see that it's over the thing so I'm gonna small it down bring it down so you guys can see what I'm doing and then after that um, I'll show you an example of basically how crystal dust looks and then there it is and another thing is um, scrolling text scrolling text so let's go back to the desktop um, you're gonna right click on add and go down to text and I use a special font called Dimitri for my um, for my let's plays and all my fonts that you guys see where it says crystal dust stream info and all that stuff I hit Dimitri and I'll put in blah 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 and after the text you always want to leave a couple spaces after so it doesn't loop and for your scroll speed you set it at 100 for that steady pace and then you hit OK so now you guys can see in the upper left hand corner that it says blah 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 and I'll just put this down in my streamer info and it's the same with um, putting it underneath this go to order right click on it go to order and then set it up underneath the uh, overlay image so and to you can also scale it just like the video is how you want it and that's pretty much it um, if you guys have any questions or comments or just got lost in the tutorial please leave a comment in the comment section um, asking me a specific part part of the question I'll be happy to help out I will definitely get back to you if not and you enjoyed it and it helped you out leave a like rating on the video and um, that's pretty much it it's been your boy D Mikey J peace